guys, Nick here with a brand new unboxing video! A game that came out in 2011, I believe, I think, whatever, what did it say on the back of this? Yes, 2011, now has been re-released with all three major DLCs, upgraded graphics, everything for Xbox One and PS4. You probably guess what game it is. It is Skyrim Remastered! I think it's called Rem Special Edition, sorry. I thought it was called Remastered, but whatever. Um, I never did unbox the first Skyrim, as far as I remember. No, I didn't start doing that until way later. But, uh, here we go. Epic Fantasy Reborn. Dragons, long lost to the passage of the Elder Scrolls, have returned to Tamriel, and the future of the Empire hangs in the balance. As Dragonborn, the... I can't pronounce some of these words. Prosfeed is... Pros... Basically, pros... Blah, 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 blah. Pros... Prosfist, whatever. Hero born with the power of the voice. Ah! Basically, he just, like, screams at him. You're the only one who can stand amongst them. Actually, anyone can. They just come back. Winner of over 200 Game of the Year awards. Special Edition. The Special Edition includes the critically acclaimed game with all new features like remastered art and effects, volumistic god rays, dynamic depth and of field, and more. Skyrim Special Edition also brings the full power of PC mods to the Xbox One. New quests, environments, characters, and more with mods. There are no limits to that you can experience. Do they have the Randy Savage mod where all the dragons just go, Yeah! That'd be awesome. Includes the add-ons, Dawn Guard, Heartfire, and Blood... I about said Bloodborne. No. Dragonborn. Yeah, they actually have a quest called Dragonborn. Rated M for blood and gore, intense violence, sexual themes, and use of alcohol. And it's only one player, clearly. Now, I could do an unboxing video of Titanfall 2, but I can't. It's digital. I bought it from GameStop also because they offered it, and I had like $24, $25 left from a trade. So I'm like, well, eh, we'll just put it towards that. So that's the kind of blade I'm dealing with right now. Yeah, it made it. Uh, it also came with a poster. I'll show that here in a minute. Uh, it's a, it was a GameStop pre-order deal or something. Why is this so difficult? Okay. So, I can't start playing this until this is done because, you know, Xbox can only do so much. Oh, God. Huh. That's neat. Oh, and it does... <laughs> uh, here's the disc. It's just exactly the same as the front. Uh, it comes with a card to get, what is it, Dragon Warrior costume and charger mount for Elder Scrolls Online. Uh, of course, the warning thing, and it actually shows what kind of buttons. It comes with a, uh, a, a map, like the original, but I think they added the things and stuff like that, whatever it means. But uh, let's go ahead and show the poster, just because... Why is there a Gengar in the bottom of my UCAM program? I don't know. All right, here it is. It's two sides. One side is this, just the Dragonborn holding two weapons. And the other, I can't quite figure it out. I think it's just like, uh, yeah, it's him looking at uh, the, the Greybeard's place. I forgot their names. Parth Parthenax place. He's not a Greybeard, but he's the uh, Master Dragon or something like that. Uh, and since I have no posters in here, I might put it right here. Why not? But, thank you for watching this. Hope you enjoyed it. Um, at some point, I'll get back to recording again. Or streaming, or whatever. I actually full-on, a month or two ago, thought I was going to stream this. I'm like, you know what? I'll play uh, Oblivion until it comes out, and then I'll do a stream of that, but then I think again, it's like, when I stream a game that just comes out, it means I can't keep going, and since this has all the DLC to it, I can't enjoy the DLC, so I decided against streaming that for now, or anything, actually, so I'm just, I'm just enjoying being a viewer, pretty much, so I will catch y'all in any future videos, so see you later.